Okay, it's a tutorial on how to kind of trace around a, a scanned paper page. Um, so it could be a diagram in a, in a book for study purposes, but in this case it's a uh, productivity tracker out of a bullet journal. Um, and certain features in Zoom Notes make it really quite straightforward to do this, uh, where it's hard in, in other apps. Um, so what I've done there is I've selected the image that's already been inserted onto this page and resized it so it's covering the page. Next thing is to add a new layer, which would be the one that I'm going to trace into. Um, and just turn down the opacity of the a layer with the image in and lock it so that it can't be moved. Um, so that's the, in, uh, the layers done. Next, uh, I'm going to want to use Draft Ink um, but not pressure sensitive. So I'll get uh, nice parallel sides to the tracing of this shape. And the final thing I want to do is turn on this smoothing function, uh, which is really useful for this because it just evens out any sort of uh, shake on um, uh, the writing stroke, um, so you get a much better end result. So I'll just I'll just do a bit without it on, and you'll kind of see it's a bit bit all over the place. I think if you're good at drawing, then maybe you'll get much straighter lines and be better at it. But for me, I can't do it, so I need to turn it on. Um, it's smoothing all the time, so if I just race around this corner, ooh, it's put a, a curve around that. So something you need to know about this smoothing function is that when you get to a, a corner, just pause briefly and then carry on. Pause, carry on. You get a lovely corner. Um, pause, carry on. Um, and that's it really. Okay, it's a little bit laborious. I'm not going to show it all, but essentially just do each of these. Okay, I messed that one up a bit. Um, and um, just get the results you need that way. The next thing is um, the um, ink here. Again, we want draft ink, but we want it to be pressure sensitive. Still want to use this smoothing function because it makes a much better result. And we um, just going to trace around. Um, you still want to bear in mind that where there's a, a kind of a corner or a change in direction where it goes from thick, uh, uh, thin to thick. Um, so I'll just do a bit here. You want to pause there and then carry on. Pause, carry on. Otherwise I'll try and get to a bit where it's a problem. If you do it too quick then it, it can um, give you an ugly result. And the th trick with this um, style of ink is a light pressure when you're drawing up, heavy pressure coming back down, light again, heavy, light, pause, heavy, pause, a bit heavier, heavier. Tiny bit of practice and you get decent results at that. Um, and that's it really, I mean it's slightly time consuming but you do get good results from it. Um, and here's one that uh, I prepared earlier, so um, good luck with that.